This video will show you how to trace a road using Jossum. First, set up an account on osm.org. Jossum will ask you for your login and password when you upload to the map. Next, download Jossum from jossum.openstreetmap.de. Once in Jossum, click the download button to download the area you wish to edit. Use your mouse wheel or double click to zoom in. Right click and drag to move around. Left click and drag to select the area. You have to be zoomed in quite close as requests for too much data will be rejected. Then click on download. The map is shown in Jossum's default style on a black background. To move around, right click and drag. To zoom in and out of the map, use the plus and minus keys or your mouse wheel. To open aerial imagery for tracing, go to the imagery menu. Bing Satellite is useful for some areas in Japan. More details are on the wiki. We will look at adding more imagery to the menu in a few minutes. To trace a road, you will need to switch from Select to Add mode. The top two buttons on the left toggle between Select and Add. The keyboard shortcuts are S for Select and A for Add. This road links to an existing road, so I'm going to click over that road to add a junction. Continue adding points to trace the shape of the road. You can still right click and drag the map while drawing. This road rejoins the main road. Place the mouse pointer over a road and it will light up blue. Click to create a junction. To end a line, either click again on the last point or hit escape. Now tag the line as a road. Open the presets menu and choose highways then streets, then choose the type of road. This road is obviously residential. It can be hard to determine the road type. Single lane non-residential roads are usually tagged as unclassified. If you are unsure, you can also choose Unknown Type. You can record other attributes, but if you are mapping remotely, you probably don't even know the name. Click Apply Preset to make the line a road. Notice that the Highway tag has appeared in the Properties dialog on the right, with a value of Residential. When tracing aerial imagery, you should record the source of the data. Click the plus sign to add a new tag. Enter the key, source, and enter details of the imagery. Once you have traced a few roads, you need to upload your data. Click on the Upload button. Jossum will warn you you have unnamed roads. You can ignore this. Enter a brief comment about your change, then click Upload Changes. You can find a list of aerial imagery for use in OSM on the Sendai Wiki page.
To add area limitry to the menu in JOSM, go to Edit Preferences, click on the WMS tab, click on the plus sign, then copy the URLs on the wiki. Copy the Get Capability URL to the Service URL box, the Get Map URL to the WMS URL box and the source description to the menu name box. Then click OK. Your imagery is now in the menu.